All right, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome back to another episode of Inscription. Uh, huh, I have an opossum instead of a rabbit pelt to start with. That's a new one. I wasn't really expecting to only have one, but that's okay. And what do we get? Hair pelt gets me. So based on hand size, ringworm. Let's just get the ringworm. It's not actually very good, but if we can find a campfire fairly early on, which we kind of can, then we can make something of it. Now let's go here. So bullfrog plus... I care not for any of these. I'm going to do bullfrog plus stoat. Let's just get rid of the two. I'll get rid of the stoat at some point if I can. Alright, and this could be a bit of a doozy. We'll see. This is the block f flying. Okay. I can work with that. Let's get the fly block stoat down. Pronghorn isn't much of a concern. Because I can get the squirrel down. And then we can burn both of these. Toss you there. And just delete it. Grab another squirrel. Could also get the possum down. Sure. Haven't quite won. And we get the ringworm, which is mostly just insult and injury, because it could do nothing. Currently. Okay, so this what new beehive, ant queen, and another cockroach. Or, no, I don't have a cockroach. That was last round. When a card bearing this sigil is played, an ant is created in your hand. Ant Queen could be really interesting. Otherwise, it could go... Hmm. Because there's the beehive, which just creates bees. Low-key, it's really tempting to actually go for the beehive. I don't remember what... I don't know if bees have a cost. There's also the ant queen, which would lead to some really interesting things if I went that direction. Or cockroach would let me get an infinite creature, but might be a bit of a albatross until then. Many of these are. Because, like, infinigoat is always a dream. If I can get Infinigoat down, I'm a happy camper. Let's go for the Cockroach. It makes for good sacrificing. Alright, let's go back to this. Okay, give them the Ringworm. And no, you can only, you can only do this twice. Somebody was saying you could do this four times. Well, but no, it... It's only two times, and unfortunately, it didn't die there. Okay, Sparrow and Sparrow. Not much for it, really. My squirrel can do nothing. I guess I could get, like, another squirrel, but... Eh. Second squirrel. Hit the wolf. And remember to actually put it where it can hit. Let's get the possum down so we can actually start doing some damage. Because I do not want to lose here. That would be embarrassing. Grab another one of these. Stoat. Stoat can block flying. Or we just wait. This is a balanced system currently. I don't even know if he has anything else that he even summons. Pop the squirrel down. Delete to get stoat. And then I'm pretty much out of cards. There we go. I could have drawn something else, but I don't remember what it would have been, and I don't think it would have been very good. Alright, what do we got? Wolf Cub, Corpse Maggots. Corpse Maggots are great. If I can pull it off. I'd like another wolf. Oh man, if I could have a... 
uh, a wolf cub that comes back. Please eat. Please eat my ringworm. I, this is a problem. Because at this point, now I'm starting to get an actually good ringworm. That I almost don't want to feed to them. Well. When in doubt, get the ringworm down. The sucker is a tank, too. Well, oh well. It'd be... It'd be pretty funny if it if it turns out that we actually just go full ringworm here. Uh, let's see. I don't have anything else. Do we sacrifice the ringworm to get a wolf down? No. I can do that separately. Sacrifice these, kill the pronghorn, get the possum down. Perfect. Oh, and there is still the possum. It's fine. Awesome, don't scare me. There we go. I don't think he has anything else. I also can't do anything else. Whatever. Decent amount of damage, some amount of teeth. Okay, what do we get? An alpha wolf, a kingfisher, or a sparrow? Um... Alpha Wolf. Okay. If this... Please eat it. Nope. Alright, we're just holding on to this thing at this point. If I get another poisonous card, cool. But at this point, now we have way too tough of a ringworm and to lose it would be sad. Now let's get rid of the corpse maggots on the alpha. Do we want to put it on the alpha? I think so. It's probably one... Uh, or do we want to put it on the wolf? These are tough. Because this way I can just get the wolf out as soon as anything dies. This would be great on, like, field mice, now that I'm thinking about it. It's a little late to make that decision, unless... Okay, let's take this up. What if we do cockroach plus ringworm? Yeah, that's the better plan. I want to see if I can get field mice or something else before I, I do the maggots. And infinite ringworm, as silly as it sounds, uh... It's not terrible. Because it's so cheap, I can get it down pretty much every round. Alright. Ooh, Prospector. Let's see how this goes. So there's a coyote. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to get these two down. Sacrifice both of them. Put the wolf down for a little bit of pre-damage. And then we're just going to wait. Because I want to hit, I want to hit the pack mule. Draw this gets me the stoat. Stoat sucks, but it's fine. Get the possum. Possum will just do its thing. Okay, keep drawing. Corpse maggots. Wolf will balance the scales. Possum will do a little bit of damage. Possum goes back. Uh, let's grab this. Put a squirrel down. We want to kill... We want to kill the coyote. Get our cards. We get a cat. Mule's defenses. Defenseless. Okay, let's just draw the last of our cards. We get our infinite ringworm. Uh, 
Okay, now he golds up all of my cards, which gets me the Corpse Maggot, which is actually really huge. Okay, get Bloodhound, draw this. Unfortunately, I don't think I can do anything with the Corpse Maggots. Oh, you know what I could have done? I could have actually made the cor Corpse Maggots unkillable. I didn't think about that. Oh well. Squirrel, ringworm. Have fun, you two. Another squirrel. I'm just gonna kind of death by a thousand ringwormy bites. Okay, what else do we have? Beaver, cat, squirrel, alpha wolf. Shit ton of squirrels. Screw it, possum. Possum kill the snake. Now, yeah, I wouldn't have been able to do a whole lot of damage. Maybe if I got the alpha down. Oh well. Okay, so do we get. Hmm. So we get Mantis God, we get Pack Rat. I really wish I could take a look look at my deck at the moment. So the big issue is, I mean, Pack Rat is always lovely. Mantis God is too good, though. Like, put that on almost anything that does, like, two damage, or just give it one buff and it's a, uh, a one-hit kill. Okay. We do have a Mycologist, but I don't think I have any... I don't have any dupes. I mean, if I get lucky, maybe I get a dupe here. We could also remove something. I'll think about it. Okay. Five bones. Six health. Or two have to be kin. I've got a couple of bugs and a couple of wolves. Let's go kin. Wolf, Ringworm, Mantis God. Okay, trial was passed. Kingfisher, Deadly Kingfisher, which is not helpful. A Beehive. The Beehive is interesting. I said I wasn't going to go bugs, but today I'm feeling bugs, I guess. Because Deadly Kingfisher is useless to me. Let me see. What do we have in my deck? So, I could put the Corpse Maggots on something. It would have almost been great to put that on, or infinite on the Corpse Maggots. I could put the Alpha Wolf on something, or I could put the Mantis God on something. Or we could keep the Mantis God. We could have the Mantis possum. That'd be hilarious. I, the smart thing to do would be to just probably put it on the wolf. It's a little expensive, but at the same time, it does have um, it has the natural stats that we're looking for. Oh, and we might have a dupe here. Yeah, let's go this way. Okay. Because I, I want to hold on to this. Put the Mantis God on. Probably the wolf. A little harder to get out. But pretty good. And if we get lucky, we get like another wolf there. Oh, but we don't have anything we can sack onto it. Unless stitching gives us an extra slot, which I hope it does. Okay. Possum, ringworm, some other stuff. Okay, let's just... Let's get our bouncing baby boy out. There we go. You cannot kill him. He's too strong for you. Um... I guess I'm gonna put the squirrel down so we can get the stoat down. Just so I can kill the fawns before they evolve. The alpha wolf. 
I don't know if he has any other summons. He should. Yeah. Don't care too much about Alpha Wolf. Corpse Maggots. Perfect. Do we just get the Corpse Maggots down? I could. It doesn't strike me as terribly practical. Okay, there's the wolf. Uh, let's see. Let's put the possum down. Sacrifice both of these to get fight wolf. Uh, let's see, and there's nothing else. Exit just gets us the kill. And a little bit of, a couple of teeth. Not that I've been particularly possessed of the desire to spend them, but it looks like I'm not going to have a choice. You can grab the magpie. Looks like we have another mycologist. I'm gonna I'm gonna gamble, see if I can get an initial dupe here. Another corpse maggot, stoat, or a possum. These are bad. We're gonna just go with the corpse maggots. I might not want a mycologist yet, though. It's kind of the thing. Okay, so we do we have a couple. What are we looking looking at? Squirrel down, ringworm down. Would have been nice to get another ringworm, as silly as it sounds. Okay. We're going to put the squirrel down. We're going to sacrifice the ringworm, because I get it back anyway. And we're going to put the wolf here. Wolf kills the fawns, and the porcupine is hardly a concern. Get another squirrel, squirrel here, ringworm kills porcupine, and I think we win anyway. Really gotta find a campfire. Let me boost the wolf further. Okay, what do you got? So the trapper gives me one of those. And I guess one of those. I could have waited. Oh. No, we want to go this way. The campfire would be nice. But this gives me a chance to offload something. Um. Hmm. Okay, so we've got a couple of options here. We've got the two corpse maggots. I'm going to sacrifice the magpie onto the corpse maggots. If we can find another roach or something to apply... Oh, right, they're flying now. That's fun. Yeah, if we can if we can find something uh, something to boost them further or make them infinite especially, um, then we're in a very, very happy spot. Okay, vulture flies... Ah. But that's not a problem. Okay, so we're going to put the stoat here. Sacrifice the stoat. Get it down. We have the beehive. It'll take the next. Oh. But it's not going to work. Oh, there's the corpse maggots. The problem is I can't do jack shit about this. I think the freaking vulture is just going to kill me. And I'm going to deserve it. Yeah, I can do nothing here. Because I can bot now. The danger is a deck bloat. I'll see what I can do about it. I mean, there's only so much. Grizzly, Raven, or a Mole. I like none of these. I guess I'm going to just get the Mole down. What we really need to do is not have it. That's the big one. Well, looks like I can just stitch the two together. Hopefully it gets me some more. That was really, I don't know. Hopefully I can still slot something else onto it. Otherwise I'm going to be a sad man. Okay, more health onto something. Huh. Not what I was expecting. Definitely not ring wolf. Ringworm. Maybe wolf anyway? 
Yeah, maybe wolf anyway. You guys have no idea how much danger you were in previously. But now, nah. It's too late. It's too late to kill him. Okay, so it's the trapper, but this time it is me. I do miss the music for this, but it was so overpowering. Alright, so we've got a couple of things here. We do have the wolf. <sighs> Big issue here is... I don't want to get the wolf down yet. So I'm going to do squirrel there. Can't get the possum. Do we... Probably should have bro broken that. Because, yeah, I could I could get the wolf down, but I don't want to. I'm just... Yeah. I'm just going to take this. Squirrel's down. Now we get the corpse... Corpse maggots. So let's me get the ringworm. Uh, let's give me another squirrel. Squirrel here. Ringworm. How am I doing? I can take one more hit. But I could also get the possum down. Perfect. Okay, that kills the possum. We don't care too much. The rabbit pelt. But we don't want to do that. Um. Oh, the corpse maggots can fly. I forgot about that little detail. Okay. This got scary, but it's fine. Because we have... Battle Wolf. There we go. Anything else? Couple of wolf pelts. Let's just put it there. It won't die. Okay. Grab Squirrel. Squirrel goes there. Ringworm goes here. Sack it again. Kill it. That kills the wolf pelt, which is just questionable, but we get another wolf pelt for our wolf pelt. Which is fine. Get the ringworm back. And he's still got a bullfrog. That's fine. Grab another squirrel. Grab ringworm. Put it here. Alright. So far, so good. This will hit him for a ton. Sadly, we don't get any overflow teeth for this, but... I think we're in a comfortable sp spot to take him out. And I'm so glad I gave my wolf that extra HP. Alright, let's trade. Okay, so we've got to take this, otherwise we're doomed. Okay, grab one of these, pop the squirrel down, and we want to put this one down for just hella damage. Alright, wolf kills itself, but I do plenty of damage, should give me a decent chunk of teeth too. Cool. I'm getting better at this, slowly but surely. I actually thought I was doing pretty well for the last couple runs, but apparently YouTube comments always say no. All right, what do we got here? I guess I'm gonna grab the strange larva. Cause I can apply that to something. Or something to that. Okay. Well, we gotta go here. Because we don't actually want regular cards. So I've got a couple of pelts. More corpse maggots. Hmm. So we've got a... Hatter that duplicates itself or more corpse maggots.
Now I gotta remember, I can't sack anything onto any of these. So the multi-adder would be interesting. The ant queen that spawns bees is weird. Blocker grizzly sounds kind of fun. I don't actually really like any of these, I think is the immediate problem that I'm looking at. All of them seem more inconvenient than helpful. Because, like, multi-adder is great for assassinating big cards, and I think that's going to be what I go for. But even then, on a practical level, eh, it's okay. Alright, let's go for bones, a goat. Oh, right, my inventory. I still have the teeth. I haven't needed them yet. Okay, these have some options. I'm going to get squirrel down. Stoat. Where do I put the stoat? I'm going to put the stoat here. Okay. And I'm going to get the squirrel here. Because the stoat's going to kill the mantis. Shit, that's a lot of bees but that's fine. Because now I got the corpse maggots down, but what we really have down... I don't actually know on this one. What's the most immediately practical? What is in my hand? Oh, shit. Because I could go for the wolf and grab a squirrel. Okay, cool. Because I didn't want to sacrifice the corpse maggots immediately. I have to balance the skills a little bit. Okay, just grab a squirrel. Can't do much with it. Keep balancing those scales. Grab another one of these. Corpse maggot. I'm going to just put it down. Kind of fun summoning the extra corpse maggots with a deluge of uh, with a deluge of squirrels. There we go. I can brain. I'm just trying to strategize a million miles away. Still can't afford that. Do we get a wolf pelt? I don't want to. That's the thing. It could get, it could give me something good, but ultimately it represents deck bloat in a bad way to me at the moment. Okay. So what do we boost? Because I've got a couple of options. Most of them are kind of crap. Oh. Okay. Honestly? The plus one damage could be really nice. Put it on the wolf, clear things faster. Put it on the ringworm, could be good. Put it on the corpse maggots. I have a lot of corpse maggots. Yeah, I do and I don't. I think I want to apply these to something else. See if we find some more sacrifice things along the way. I think I want to... Uh... Okay, here's what we're going to do. This actually, that worked. I'm gonna give them sacrificial lambs. Things that I do not want. And then hope for the best. So, if I go here, this gives me stuff. If I go here, this gives me cards. I wish I could look further ahead. I think I'm gonna go here first. Reason being, this way I can make a choice. This way I'm locked in on one side. Wolf, stoat, rabbit, pelt, cool. Gonna put the rabbit pelt there. Block it. Put the stoat. Okay, get the squirrel. Here's the question. 
do we sacrifice? Yeah. Because if I just put that down, I think we win anyway, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it. Yep. We do just enough damage. Okay, go here. This lets me pick something of any breed. Go wolf. Gets me a wolf. Do I have a totem? I don't. I never got one. But I think I want to go here. Okay, who do we get rid of? The mole. Fortunately, it's only a gift of one bone, but whatever. One one starting bone still goes a ways. So I don't think I'm going to get a totem, so I think we want to go here. See what I can sacrifice. I'm trying really hard to clear out my hand, but it is not that forthcoming. Or my hand, my deck. Oh shit, because... Oh, good lord. Um... Okay. I'm gonna get that down there. We're gonna get the stoat down. Stoat... Stoat's gonna go here. And that gives me just enough that I can put the possum down. Perfect. Okay, we get the beehive. Okay. I think I lose. Nope, not quite. Oh, we get the other corpse maggots, but I still can't get it down. Okay, corpse maggots go here. Give me the wolf. Because I don't think I'm winning without it. Okay, sack both of those. Put wolf down. So... I think I'm doomed. If I put the wolf on the right, we would have won that one. It's okay, we still have one more candle. I totally forgot about the tails and I don't it's fine okay what do we get beehive river snapper or worker ant I grab this second beehive I it's really bad I, I, I need less cards and we're not gonna find our mycologist so do we want to do strange larva or corpse maggots. I'm going to put the corpse maggots on something. I mean, honestly, alpha wolf is tempting. It's not great, but it probably presents one of the better boosts that I could get. We'll see. I might want to make it stronger, but I might also want to just make regular wolf stronger. Or we could... We might lose the alpha wolf for this, but it's worth it. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. At this point, I'm just going for it. We'll see what happens. I, I went doubles on pretty much all of those, and they never ate a single thing. I think they knew what I was trying to do to them. Oh, interesting. He just gave me the chum bucket buckets right off the bat. Alright. He's got a raven. As well. Strange larva, just put it here. Fortunately, it takes a while to go. Tragic. I guess I'm gonna grab this. Alpha, 
And we're gonna give him a rabbit pelt. Have fun there. He didn't take my pelt. Because the alpha took it. You know what? Uh, if I go back to the start screen. If I continue run. I, at this point, save scum is my my only only recourse. I don't I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this. We have the black goat, but our our initial draw here is abysmal. And so there's a very re real possibility we are dead. But I do not go quietly into the night. Okay, squirrels. Black goat. Adder. Here. Okay, we still have some of these. And if I put the rabbit pelt there... Oh, interesting. He moves it. Give him a squirrel. Okay. He, interesting enough, didn't grab a damn thing. Alright. And how do we want to do this? Because the big immediate issue is... Oh, I'm going to grab the alpha. Yeah, the, the problem is I'm I'm dooming myself here that I I have to not have my creature die. If it dies, then we get the summon and he takes it. I wish it didn't work that way. That's okay. Well, I won't get the rabbit pelt down. That was pointless. I don't know. I think maybe the the winning move take the tooth. And just do nothing. There might actually be no way way for me to win at this point. R RNG could have truly ruined ruined me cuz I I don't this this freaking thing, and I mean, just in general, I, I had uh, I had a rather rude comments yelling at me that I need to cleanse my deck of cards harder and like not take so many. But like, how the hell do you take less cards in this game? It is purely RNG sometimes whether or not you actually get to take or keep cards. I mean, maybe if I hadn't gone for that mycologist that one time, but even then, I don't know. Here's the problem. I put that there. Wait. I think I could have done that. I I think I think I get it. I might I might have the solution here otherwise I don't know. But I, I do notice that I have particularly bad, like, draw RNG. I, I think so much of it boils down to starting with only three cards and a squirrel is really, really terrible. There's not much you can do about it. Okay, we put the squirrel here. Reason being is because he puts the great white there in kind of preparation. We take a second squirrel. We put it here. We get the adder down, which kills that. Then we put the rabbit pelt here. We don't lose anybody. No, we do. I hate everything. I don't know. Give me the wolf. Give me the cards. Maybe I can... Sack both of these... Buggers. 
Um, now, because here's the problem. This is going to summon a... Um, Great White. Unless... Nope. Because it summons a Great White. And then I get absolutely crushed. Nothing I could do. Go fish.